previously on Bumbling Tourist. We took a riverboat cruise down the Irrawaddy River, arriving in Began for a beautiful sunset over the ancient stupas. Welcome to Old Began. That looks beautiful, eh? Yeah. We're in Myanmar. That's adventure. What up, Internet? Hi there, camera. This is our first day in Began. Yeah, I wanted to have this tree in the background. We got these bicycles. And there's a Bogum Villa. And there's a, a temple. Should be an exciting day. Yeah, I hope so. Let's go on an adventure. exhausting. Who knows? <laughs> I need the exercise. <laughs> That's so pretty. We've only gone about four feet from where we started, and uh, we already found this. Yeah, it's amazing. You used to be able to climb to the top of most of the temples in Bagan to sit on the roofs of these structures. However, less and less of these buildings allow access to tourists as time goes by. We were successful in finding a temple to ascend later on in this very video. Temple number two. Or Paya number two. For our first full day in Beigan, we decided to rent bicycles from our hotel. It cost about $5 to rent the bicycles for half a day. This was a great way to explore our immediate surroundings as the main temples can be very far apart. The terrain in Beigan is very rocky, dusty, and steep at times, so we definitely earned our beer after six hours of biking up and down hills in Beigan. Began is an ancient city and a UNESCO World Heritage Site. From the 9th to 13th century, Began was the capital of the Pagan region. During its height, Began contained over 10,000 stupas and pagodas, of which roughly 2,200 remain.
you excited? Two for two. Yeah, good stuff. Why is that? Because you're doing so many things at the same time. What if you bike and you run into something and you hurt yourself? I don't think there's anything around. Yeah, but you can fall and hurt yourself on yourself or the ground or the bicycle. Nah, boys are made out of rubber. Not boys that are almost 40. <laughs> Look at all this rubber. amazing stuff. Shall we hop on our bikes and ride? Yeah. I like to ride my bicycle. I like to ride my bike. I like to ride my bicycle. I like to ride it where I like. There's this temple, and there's that temple, and there's that temple, and there's that temple. You dance to paya 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 paya. Sure. Have you noticed the parkour squirrels? No, but this is a brilliant place for squirrels to practice their parkour skills. Yeah. Although that one looks like it's moving pretty slow. They are running up the side. You just oh. missed it. This pagoda is super decorative. Yeah. And all of its details. I like when there's little faces like that guy. Yeah. Does it have a name somewhere? I guess I'll go look. Because I'm worried that in seeing so many, they'll kind of blur together. And I'd like to keep some perspective. It doesn't say the name of this one, just this temple. But this name here is that one over there. So we can look for that one if you want to come here.
going to give you some instructions on how to take a good photo. All right. From this temple, we had one of the best views of Old Baigan. We returned here for sunrise the next day, but the viewpoint was swarming with tourists. I know a lot of the um, pagodas are closed now, so you can't climb on them. But this is just as good as. Look at that view. I think it's my favorite one so far. How about you? We pretty interchangeably call these payas, stupas, and pagodas. But these are all different things. A stupa has no opening, so it's more like a dome-shaped structure that's been erected as a Buddhist shrine. A temple, or pagoda, you can enter, whereas a paya is the overarching term for all of these structures. We then bicycled to a tiny village halfway between Old Began and New Began. This area is famous for Manuha Temple and its 11th century reclining Buddha. First time I've seen a thing that's a smoking zone. So this is where we are right now. And there's a little bit of information on here. Um, apparently we're no longer in Began, we're in a city called Mayin Kaba, is that it? And this temple was built in 1067 um, by a captive king. And it's two stories, and it contains three images of Buddha, a uh, seated Buddha and an image of Buddha entering Nirvana. And it is one of the oldest temples in Began. Awesome. Yeah. It's funny that it's one of the oldest temples in Began, and you're saying that this isn't technically Began. No, well, Began in general. Began, Shire. Like the Big End region? Nasty Hobbitses. Buddha's feet. Wow. I think this is Buddha entering Nirvana. Well, there were birdies eating that rice. Now the birdies got scared away. The birds. Come back, the birds. Exhausting day, though. It's hot. <laughs> I realized that visiting temple after temple might seem tiring, but honestly, who can tire of pretending to be Indiana Jones? At all temples and stupas in Myanmar, you must remove your shoes. A slip-on pair of shoes will save you lots of time.
so it seems like you can go up that one if you're super super skinny and you're not as paranoid as the holly is because i went up there i peeked my head out and there's this man walking furiously up the hill and i thought he's coming to bust me so i scurried back down <laughs> but he wasn't coming to us at all so yeah you need to relax yeah i have a hard time doing that pretty cool though but yeah the size of about your backpack is the space you have to crawl through so we just ate at this amazing place and normally when we eat while we're traveling we'll take pictures we'll take videos we have all this content but we got our dishes I ordered the uh, hot and sour Japanese style tofu parentheses spicy with rice and, uh, what did you get? I got traditional uh, Myanmar potato curry. And rather than take a single picture or photo or video or anything, uh, just devoured it like hungry monsters because it was so amazingly good. So, if you're here in uh, Bagan, my goodness, come here. The staff is incredibly friendly. The place is brilliant. A thousand stars. <laughs> Now to get on our bikes and ride. Yeah. Get on your bike and ride. Do you want the key? I guess you probably want the key. Yeah, I'll need the key. All right. I really like the painting in here. Do I make you nervous when I drive? No. Just bicycles, right? My driving is impeccable. Bicycles, not so much. I like bicycles. It's the only thing you can drive. You ruined my shot. It was a video. You walked right through the middle. A fugly guy and such pretty flowers. Holly shot. It's where you take a video or picture behind some flowers. It's my shot. I claimed it. And yet this feels like my hand holding the camera. Oh, yeah, maybe. We mentioned a lot of people in Began are artists, and they try to sell you their paintings. A lot. Hello. For the last stop on our bike riding tour of Began, we stopped at an old monastery, or at least the ruins of one, likely built between 1060 and 1160 AD and ruined by the many earthquakes in Began.
Definitely. This looks more like a monastery than a stupa or a pagoda or a temple. Just a lot of little rooms off of the center. This place is pretty cool. We wanted to mention that this series was filmed in February 2020. A lot has changed in the world and in Myanmar since. Myanmar was the friendliest and most welcoming country we have ever visited. As we release these videos in this series, it's 2021, and the citizens of Myanmar are risking their lives to protest a military overtake of the government. We certainly are no authority on what's going on, but we definitely encourage you to keep up to date with what's happening.